Hello, it's Friday, April the 5th. It's about 4.30, p.m. And I'm here at 251 Sherburn Street. 257 Sherburn Street. Um, according to um, um, news from CBC investigation, uh, they had detected that um, this community suffers cons consistently of, of uh, false fire alarms. So I am in the seventh floor right now of this building, uh, TCAC property, to see um, how many uh, cameras are available in this floor. I just noticed one that is covered in paint uh, spray, and uh, there's nothing here. Um, So it's a long hallway, as you can see. Oh, there's a camera right here. And it also has been damaged, apparently. So I'm gonna go now into the stairway. It has been a spray or something, I don't know, for protective shields from graffiti paint. Look at the condition of this. Look at the condition of this place. Horrible. Also, the, some spray thing going on over there. So, on the sixth floor, laundry room. So, it's pretty similar to uh, places like. 303 Greenwood, I mean Jurai Street, sorry. Um, places like 220 Oak Street, where totally the number of uh, comments are missing in the floors. So, here we go. Thank you. Oh, yeah. So that's the exit. Oh, it's an exit over there. It's an exit door. Eventually, it will take me to the garbage chute. Here. On sixth floor, B side. It's a little cleaner. The B side compared to the A side of the building. Yeah. I just kind of wonder why the purpose of this. and details. There has to be a situation where cameras are being vandalized. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna go to the elevator now on the fifth floor. So that's a map of the floors. So we went over here and we went here. Uh, we didn't check this out there. Maybe we should. Yeah, let's go check it out. So there's another door here. As I go, there's the exterior of the building. And there it is. There is the stairway. And this is no cameras in here on the fifth floor, west side. There's no cameras in here. 
pretty smelly, pretty yucky. Seems like people have urinated, vandalized. No, no cameras over here. Going down to the third floor. Yeah, there's a camera. There's a car, paint. That sucks. That totally sucks. Yep. The camera over there. Also damage. So we travel the east, uh, the south, the north there, and the west is there. Yeah, and there's one camera in this location. There's one location here, another one in this area, and there's another one over here. And most of them are vandalized, have been covered with paint, spray on. <laughs> this is a serious problem here. Uh, no wonder we have some, you know, problems. So how are we gonna use, uh, deal with these matters? Poverty is one of the main reasons. Poverty, no employment, poverty everywhere. Anyway, I'm gonna wait for the elevator to come. I noticed there's no camera on the elevator. I'm gonna confirm this information. Yep, it's gonna come any minute. Well, I wait. Again, I'm in 251 slash 257 Sherburne Street. As I said before, um, this building is the, has been labeled as the first offender in all the TCAC buildings of fire violations, fire code violations, um, false alarms, which are costly for the city. Um, well, I understand the reasons people do the damage. Some, sometimes it's trauma, psychological issues. I don't know. I don't know the reason why people want to destroy stuff, but hey, I'm not here to pass judgment. I'm here to help. <laughs> we can. Here we go. The elevator finally is here. No, there are no cameras at all. Nope. There are no cameras in here, as far as I see, unless they have a hidden camera somewhere, but I don't really believe that. Anyhow, here we are. Well, hi, Mr. Hello, how are you? Good, good, good. So, that's the story here. Camera, working camera, there's no spray on it. There's another working camera, it's not, it hasn't been a spray on. But well, anyway. 251 and 250 Sherburne Street. It's a crazy problem here. But well, it's a working camera right there. And it's not being sprayed on. Another one over there. Yeah. 257 property okay we'll see how this helps understand the problem that we face in these community communities bye for now